John Henry was a little bitty boy. No bigger than the palm of your hand. Ed Mammy looked down at Henry and said, John gonna be a steel driving man, Lord, Lord. John gonna be a steel driving man. John Henry had a little woman. Her name was Polly Ann. John Henry got sick and he had to go to bed. And Polly drove that steel like a man, Lord, Lord. Polly drove that steel like a man. hear you sing I swing for the nine pound from my hips on down Lord I love to hear that cold steel ring love to hear that cold steel ring John and me went to the tunnel to drive steam hammer by side oh the mountain was so tall Henry was so small he laid down his little old hammer and he cried he laid down his hammer and he cried Put him six feet under the sand Every time a freight train would go puffing by That's a young Eliza Steel driving man, Lord, Lord Yeah, and there lies a steel driving man John Henry was a steel driving man <laughs> Alan Morrison, that's great. Next group coming on to our Bluegrass Caravan stage is headed up by two young fellows who are nephews of the late and great Bud Rose. I'm talking about Glenn with his five-string banjo and Johnny Rose with his guitar. I've never met two better youngsters than these boys, and I've never met two better musicians. I hope you'll make them welcome here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, the Rose Brothers and Stony Creek Grass. How about a nice hand for them, huh?